In this video tech tip, I'll be going over the process for adding pressure pipe content from Plan 3D into a Civil 3D pressure network catalog. This can be accomplished in a three-step process of importing a Plan 3D database into Infrastructure Parts Editor, publishing the parts to a new catalog file, and creating a parts list in Civil 3D to use the new content. In order to complete these steps, you'll need Civil 3D 2018.1 or later with Infrastructure Parts Editor installed along with Plant 3D. And I'd recommend using the same version of Plant 3D and Civil 3D to keep things consistent. The first step is to launch IPE and import content from Plant 3D. For this example, I'm using the 2021 product versions and content from the sample project that gets installed with Plant 3D. From the Create Design panel in Civil 3D, launch the IPE. On the Catalog tab, select Import from Plant 3D. The Spec Sheets folder contains content information for the Plant 3D product. Select the folder and choose which content to import. After the import is complete, click Close to dismiss the dialog box, then Open by File to see what was imported. Now that we've confirmed the parts have been imported from Plant 3D, we can publish them to a new Pressure Network catalog file. Back in the Infrastructure Parts Editor, use the Publish tab to publish the imported parts out to a catalog. Be sure to check the catalog location, as the default was set to the 2018 folder even though I'm using the 2021 version of Civil 3D. Reset the file path for the current version that you're using, and be sure that it updates before you click OK. When the succeeded message pops up on the screen, click OK to dismiss the dialog box. Now that we've exported new pipe catalog content for Civil 3D, we can create a parts list and select the catalog to populate its parts. Back in Civil 3D, use the Set Pressure Network Catalog option to verify that the parts are available. If it's missing, the published file may have been saved in the wrong location. If that's the case, find and move the published file or republish to the correct folder from IPE. With the catalog set, we can create a new pressure parts list with the content from Plant 3D to use with Civil 3D's pressure pipe layout tools. Create the parts list and populate the parts as usual. The parts that I imported from Plant 3D were fittings, so those are the parts that are available for import from the new catalog. If you have access to Civil 3D and Plant 3D, this is a quick and easy way to import more content for use with Civil 3D pressure pipe networks. This process is also outlined in a reference article on the Autodesk Knowledge Network at the link below.